Hey, how's everyone doing out there tonight? This is Chris. I'm in Las Vegas. It is Sunday. It is Sith Wave Sunday. It is Studio Sunday. And Studio Sunday is the day where I go through some piece of gear in my uh, studio and I uh, give a review of it. So today I'm going to do a comparison of the Behringer Model D and the Core Voca Bass. Now they're both three oscillator synthesizers. They're ones a clone of a 1970s mono synth, the uh, the Moog Model D, and one is a a new a neo synth. It's a little box synth, but it's got a lot of power in it. Now they're both three oscillator synthesizers. They both are two different, completely two completely different animals. But at the same time, as they both sound alike, they both have the same power, so to speak. Um, I'm going to play them both side by side in comparison and show you their similarities and tell you all the cool stuff that I like about both of them. It's been a while since I've done one of these. I hope everybody's had an awesome, awesome uh, Halloween. All I did Halloween was eat pizza and lots and lots of sweets. Now to play both of these uh, synthesizers, I'm using my favorite guitar. I have a Korg RK100. It's a 1980 synthesizer. I am using a, a MIDI box to play both of them on MIDI. I have got a Korg Voca bass and a Korg and a Behringer uh, Model D. Together, I'm gonna play them both together and separate so you see how they both sound. So I have both synthesizers hooked up to the uh, Korg RK100. We're gonna play them side by side and see how they sound. So here are both of the synthesizers side by side. This is the Korg Volca Bass and this is the Behringer Poly, <laughs> the Behringer, <laughs> the Behringer Poly D. Now, what uh, links both of these is they're both a three oscillator uh, synthesizer. Now, on the uh, Korg, the Korg Voca bass, you have uh, VCO1, VCO2, VCO3. On the uh, Behringer Model D, you have uh, um, oscillator one, oscillator two, oscillator three. You could turn them all off and on by one, two, the off and on switch one, two, and three. I'm going to turn those all on. Let's link oscillator one, two, and three on the Voca bass, and let's play them both separately so you can hear how they sound. Let's start with the uh, Korg Voca bass. <laughs> Heavy, thick, thick sound with that. That's all three of them working together. Let's do the same with the uh, Behringer Model D. Okay. Just as heavy, just a little bit thicker with that. Just a little bit thicker with that sound. Now we're gonna go through all three of the oscillators one by one so you can hear them on both of them together. Let's see, let's start with oscillator number one on the Korg Voca Bass. Now, all of my oscillators, when I, I work with both of these, they have three oscillators. I've separated Oscillator one, two, and three, and one, two, and three by an octave, so they all go up uh, three octaves. Oscillator one, I always put on a low octave. Oscillator two, I put on a middle octave. Oscillator three, on a higher octave, whether I do it by an octave or two. I want there to be a nice, thick, unified sound when I put all three notes together, even though it's a monosynth. When you put when you layer three notes that are the same notes on top of each other in a different octave, it brings out a big, thick, nice, full voice. That's what I'm looking for. Let's try this out. Oscillator number one on uh, the vocal bass. 
Ah, super thick base there. Let's do oscillator number one on the uh, Behringer model D. Here we go. Little. All right. Let's switch to number two on the vocal bass. Nice middle range. Number two, oscillator number two on the Behringer Model D. Another nice middle range. Now, number three, a nice high upper range. I could bring it up an octave even more. It's almost like a piccolo. Let's do that on the Model D. Super cleaner, but the same. Nice high upper sound. Now we're gonna do them both together in unison. All three oscillators on the vocal bass. Let's bring it down. Listen to that bass. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Now, Let's do that again with the uh, Behringer Model D. Other than with the frequency flapping around like that, you'd almost think it was the exact same synth. Now, uh, two completely different worlds are going on there. So I'm gonna play the same bass line on both of those, just so you could see that I'm switching back and forth. Here we go. I'm gonna start with the uh, Korg, Korg Boca. Nice, Korg Boca. Now, again, with the Behringer Model D. Now, just to make the uh, layers even thicker, richer, heavier, together. that resonates in the room, you'd love it, man. Now the awesome thing about the oscillators when they're all working together, you could use them separately, you could use them apart. The biggest difference between the both of these is this just has more manipulation in your sound. You could even um, plug in some external sound into there. Um, I have a, uh, a keytar where you can't manipulate the sound on, I would love to plug it into that so I can manipulate the sound on it. Uh, what else can this thing do? It's got more nodules and, and, uh, and dials to turn. It's got more power as far as that. The uh, Korg Voca bass on it, the other hand, even though it's laid out really simple, anyone could use it. It's not that hard to learn how to use and you could program a whole bunch of different sequences in it. It's got a step sequencer in it. It's got a real-time sequencer in it as well. I really love that. Sometimes I hook up the Behringer Model D to a, an old school uh, MIDI sequencer. They can both do the exact same thing if you put them together. So... 
You couldn't even distinguish them apart. Ah, actually, you could say this one's a little flat. Just a little flat, but basically almost the same synth, completely different package, completely different, uh, completely different era. I hope everybody's still remaining happy and safe and well. Um, we're going into the holiday season. Please, everyone, kiss and love and hug in a nice, respectable way. <laughs> All the people in your household that you love. Um, Continue to wear masks, continue to wash your hands, continue to be respectful to each other. Um, music heals. Big health, happiness, and love from Las Vegas. Um, happy Synth Wave Sunday.